peeps. Look at my t-shirt. Got pinks on it. Um, I'm in a rush. I need to leave. Um, we were going to IHOP this morning. I'm so excited about it. I've been in America for over a week and I haven't been to IHOP yet. So that needs to get rectified. Um, so I'm meeting Sam in the lobby and then we're walking to the main gate to meet Claudia. And then Rene, because he lives closer to IHOP, he's just meeting us there. So I'm so excited. I got a message from my roommate today saying that she's coming back in the afternoon. Um, she didn't specify a time, so I'll probably be here because we'll probably be done at IHOP by like one. <laughs> so that's kind of scary. Um, but yeah, let's go. Oh yeah! <laughs> taking over this vlog. Um, <laughs> oh my gosh, she's finally out of retirement. Don't do anything rude, okay? No, you know, I would never. I'm like the most innocent person in the world. Leave, delete all the stuff that's um, embarrassing, I beg you. No, so we just, we've just um, eaten at, what's this place called? IHOP. Um, and I had a lot of food. And um, they're like making fun of me, I don't know why. So let's make fun of them. What do you, did you enjoy your food? Listen, now I'm going to do an interview. Tell me what you ordered. What did you order? What did you order? He's not cooperating. Uh, what did you order? I can't remember what I forgot as well, that's what I'm trying to say. Unlimited pancakes. Oh, you can eat pancakes? Yeah. Yeah. But you didn't with do eggs that. and bacon. With eggs, bacon, sausage. So and how would you, sausage. how would you judge it? Sausage. What? How would you judge it? What do you give it out of ten? Uh, eight out of ten. Yeah. Eight out of ten. That's Why not good. ten? Because I eat a lot, <laughs> and I shouldn't have. Okay. I'm gonna get diabetes. I think I will too. Yeah. Um, well, hold up. Let's let's turn it around. Yeah. What's your question? Let me get you. Okay. What did you eat? And, I uh, had how do you rate um, this? a combo of French toast, strawberry and banana French toast with hash brown and egg, sunny side up. Wow. And I had an extra hash brown because I didn't have bacon, because I'm vegetarian. I'm uh, trying to do like a cinematography like. Yeah. yeah, but I rate it a nine actually. Actually, no, I rate it an eight. What? What are you saying? I You're rate it an about? eight, yeah, because uh, the hash browns are a bit weird. I feel like they needed a bit more salt. I can agree. Can you agree? Yeah. ¿Cómo estuvo tu comida? Muy bien, pero las patatas... Potatoes. I don't know. Yeah. What, fries? <laughs> how would you say... Pomme de terre. Oui. How would you oui. say... <laughs> no, how would you say... Uh, yeah, we're yeah, just waiting for her to come back. It's a video. It's not for me. It's not She's famous, so... It's not my camera! Oh my god, it's not my camera. You've lost your pen. Sorry. Um, anyway, how would you say hash brown in... What's hash? Hash, What's the term no. of hash? Like, the, the potatoes that we had. So, ma mashed... What is no. it? Would you say patatas fritas? Sí. Okay. Um, Así que uh, tuvo patatas fritas, fritas con toast francés. Tostadas francesas. Tostadas francesas uh, con fresas o frutillas. Bien. Uh, y bananas. She's out of retirement. Bananas. Oh, yeah. Bananas. Bananas. Yes. Um, y uh, huevos. Huevos. Huevos fritas, fritos. Fritos. Um, <laughs> y, um, oh my god. Pensé, ¿qué? 
Tuesday night, it's six o'clock. I got home about half an hour ago. And my roommate is here, but she's not. <laughs> I mean, her stuff is here. Literally, like, she's got bags down there and stuff. So I'm such a worry pot anyway. Like, I'm really getting really nervous. Like, I wish she would just turn up. I think her phone is here because something keeps vibrating unless it's her computer. Um, today was really fun. We went to IHOP. Oh my god, IHOP is the best place on the planet. Um, had like two coffees and you only pay for one because it's a free refill. Praise the Lord. <laughs> and then I had the split decision breakfast. So you get sausages, bacon, hash brown, French toast and pancakes. Oh my god. Um, but now I'm really hungry because we had that like six hours ago. Um, so Sam just messaged me saying, do you want to go to Chipotle in an hour? So I've said yeah, because I'm fucking starving and I don't know where my roommate is. So I'm just getting really nervous and I'm sweaty and I don't want my first impression to be a sweaty one. <laughs> Hi guys. I haven't spoken to you in forever and that's because I've been so busy. <laughs> So I think the last time I spoke to you was before my roommate moved back, and that was Tuesday night. It is now Wednesday, no, ugh, Thursday evening. Um, so she got back probably sometime in the afternoon, but I was out all day. And then I went out for dinner with Sam, and when I got back, it was probably about nine, she was here. Um, but so was everyone else. Everyone in the dorm moved back. Um... So they are all so nice. They are like the loudest stereotypical American girls. Like, oh my god, like screaming all the time. <laughs> but they are so, so nice. Um, and every time I speak, they love it, <laughs> which is great. Um, and my roommate is great. She's called Tanya. Um, and she's awesome. I had my first day of classes yesterday. Um, which was so scary, but everyone's kind of in the same boat as me because everyone comes to these classes alone Like they don't know anyone and then They have to try and make friends because the school is so huge Like it's rare that you're gonna get into the same class as your friends um, So I had theatre dance first. We didn't actually dance She just went over the syllabus because this week is called syllabus week or silly week because people literally just get drunk and then like don't go to class because it's you like don't really do anything um but she said that we're going to be dancing to hamilton and like chicago and newsies and oh my god i'm so excited for that um and then we did yoga we actually did do yoga it was kind of hard 
because I'm like brand new to it and she was just like okay do this do this and I'm like I don't know what that is like I need to start from the beginning um but it was kind of just like a follow class like she was just doing it at the front so you just copied her um she didn't actually teach us anything so I don't quite know what it's going to be like it's only twice a week and it's only 50 minutes so it's going to be fine um and then I had jazz dance <laughs> I am dropping that class um I am doing another jazz class which I just did today and it's so much better so I am dropping the technique class because it's all dance majors and they are all like so slim so flexible it's literally like they are conservatoire level dancers like I was at the beginning I was like yeah I could do this because he was like doing pumps for like the warm-up and he was doing like stretches and I was like okay I can do this like I'm fine with this. And then he was like, okay, everyone, go into your splits. I was like, um, I'll try. Um, and then he was like, okay, everyone get up. We're going to go across the floor. I was like, okay, well, I can do this because I do it at Roehampton. We had to do split leaps and jumps and literally, like, his routines were like, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Like, not even that. One and two and three. I was like, are you fucking serious? And normally it's fine because, like, I do hip hop. Hip hop is fast. But this was, like, get your leg up and down in half a count. I will be dropping that because I, like, stood out like a sore thumb. It was really embarrassing. Like, and I couldn't just leave. Um, so I'm not doing that class anymore. Um, and then I had dance culture. And that was fine. Um, it was really funny, actually, because when I walked in, there was a small group of people. And they were like, hi. And I was like, hi, I'm Sam. And then instantly they were like, oh my god, she's British. And there's a girl from Australia. And she was like, oh my god, I need to come and speak to you. So she like ran over and sat next to me. And we had to stand up in front of the whole class, like when they called out the register. And introduce ourselves and like say what we did over the break. So I stood up and I was like, hey, I'm Sam. I spent my break in London because that's where I'm from. And literally everyone was like, there's a British girl. And it was just so funny. Like everyone loves you here. Like people hear your accent and they're like... Um, so it's good. <laughs> we went out last night. Oh my god. We went to all the frat parties. So there's a row on the university called Greek Row. And it's literally all the Greek houses, like all the frats and the sororities. Um, and basically, on these nights, all the frats hold a party. And only girls are invited. And they're so funny, because you walk up to the door, and the boys are there, and they open the door for you. And it's like, thanks pal. <laughs> thanks for letting me into your house for free um and then you get alcohol for free because you're a girl um and it's just so funny you kind of just kind of hop from house to house like seeing which one's got the best party and seeing which one has the best drinks um but we only went to two last night because two of them uh two of the others that we wanted to go to got shut down by the police <laughs> i was like i am not taking that chance i'm not getting deported <laughs> Like, it's just, like, a massive house party, but, like, people are going... Like, they all have DJs, they all have, like, buckets of alcohol, like, you all drink from the red cups. I was like, hey, this is just America. Um, so it was so fun. And my friends are so lovely. Like, they looked out for us, so it was so nice. So, yeah, doing that again tonight. <laughs> Help. Luckily, my class today wasn't until 2, so I was fine. And I had leftover food from yesterday's dinner, so I ate that for breakfast, so I didn't have to leave the house. Not going out Friday. If they say they're going out Friday, I don't think I can. I literally, I'm not capable of doing that. Three nights in a row. I mean, I did Freshers Week, which was like seven nights in a row. But that was when I was 18. Yeah. I'm nearly 20. I'm getting too old. Okay. <laughs> Bye.